In the cold, silent emptiness beyond Mars, something impossible is moving. An object that should not exist. An object that ignores every rule written in our physics textbooks. Its name is 3i Atlas. And once again, the world is asking the same question. What is Atlas? Before we go deeper, if mysteries of the universe fascinate you, make sure you subscribe to Zid Wisdom, because what you're about to hear may change how you look at the cosmos. A research team led by Harvard astrophysicist Dr. A.V. Loeb detected a faint radio absorption signal using the Mir KAT radio telescope in South Africa. The signature matched hydroxyl molecules. Normally, these appear when a comet's frozen surface begins to vaporize from heat, but this time, something was wrong. The signal wasn't emission, it was absorption. That means the molecules weren't glowing, they were blocking light from behind. Loeb's team checked the Doppler shift, the motion of the signal relative to Earth. The readings matched perfectly with the speed and direction of 3i Atlas. Confirming one thing, the signal was real, and it came directly from Atlas. But the real shock came next. China's Tianwen-1 Mars orbiter was quietly redirected. Instead of observing Mars, it pointed its precision cameras 30 million kilometers outward toward the interstellar object. The images it captured were sharper than anything seen from Earth, sharper than even Hubble's latest frames. Atlas glowed with a cold blue halo, smooth, uniform, strangely calm. Where physics predicted chaos, the camera saw harmony. Where heat should have ripped its jets into violent streams, the light shimmered evenly like breath held in space. From October 1st to 4th, Tianwen-1 captured new images every day. Each one showed the same phenomenon. Seven faint plumes surrounding Atlas, but no tail, no debris, no fragmentation, just controlled motion. And yet, here it was, moving with intent. While this was unfolding, NASA's high-resolution Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter images taken on October 23rd remained unreleased. Scientists requested them, Congress requested them, but nothing was published. NASA simply said, data processing is ongoing. Becoming fainter, and we might miss something critical. Around the world, astronomers repeated the same concern. Why is the highest resolution data still locked away? But the deeper mystery was unfolding somewhere else. Atlas is accelerating, not slowing down like every comet does after perihelion. But speeding up. NASA's own orbital models confirm it, a measurable non-gravitational acceleration, which means something is pushing it. If it were outgassing, Atlas would need to eject billions of tons of material. The sky would be filled with dust. Every telescope would see a massive glowing cloud. Instead, nothing, no plume, no burst, not even a faint trace. So what's pushing it? Solar radiation pressure, maybe. But that only works on objects with ultra-thin reflective surfaces, like a solar sail. Which would mean Atlas isn't a comet at all. It's designed. Adding more fuel to the controversy, Atlas entered our solar system from a region just nine degrees away from the famous 1977 WOW signal. Coincidence? Maybe. But coincidences are where discoveries begin. Loeb suggested something bold. When Atlas passes 53 million kilometers from Jupiter in March 2026, the Juno spacecraft should aim its antennas toward it to listen, to scan frequencies Earth cannot detect, to capture anything Atlas might emit some called it unnecessary. Others called it humanity's chance to know the truth. Internal memos hinted at restricted distribution imaging. Scientists outside the agency grew frustrated. Even China released more imagery than NASA did. As January passed, Atlas displayed a new behavior. Its brightness began to pulse. Once every 22 hours, a perfect rhythm a pulse from the deep. And then came the moment that changed everything. On February 18th, the Green Bank Telescope detected faint radio bursts at 50 hertz, the same frequency Juno was told to monitor near Jupiter. Then, the shock. The bursts matched the exact moment Atlas crossed behind Jupiter's magnetic field. 
almost as if something inside it reacted. NASA quietly acknowledged the variation, but offered no detailed explanation. If you're still watching, tap like and subscribe to Zid Wisdom, because what comes next is the most important part of the story. March 16th, 2026. Atlas reached its closest point to Jupiter. Juno listened for six continuous hours, and it heard something, a faint rhythmic pulse, repeating in perfect 22-hour intervals, matching the optical pulse seen from Earth. Not interference, not noise, not random cosmic static. A pattern. NASA issued a generic line, magnetic interference from Jupiter. But radio engineers disagreed. The curve was too clean, too precise, too structured. Inside NASA, some Juno telemetry packets were marked, restricted distribution. Meanwhile, China's Tianwen orbiter released another set of images, a glowing symmetrical blue sphere, no jets, no debris, no tail, just motion. By mid-March, one thing became undeniable. Atlas was no longer slowing down. Its speed stabilized at 243,000 kilometers per hour, as if something inside it was maintaining velocity, correcting motion, adjusting course. Loeb compared NASA's models. The numbers didn't lie. We're watching an object that behaves like it knows what it's doing, he said. By April, more than 200 observatories were tracking Atlas. Its color shifted from deep blue back to red, not cooling, cycling. Then came the Pentagon's quiet update. Controlled rotational stabilization pattern detected. Controlled, not random. In May, the James Webb Telescope caught intermittent pulses of ionized hydrogen, appearing and disappearing every 22 hours. A language of light, a rhythm, a heartbeat. A heartbeat. By June, Atlas moved beyond Mars's orbit. Its glow dimmed, its pulses weakened, but the 22-hour rhythm never stopped. A.V. Loeb wrote his final report. A controlled fading, not random dimming, he proposed one last mission. A solar sail probe to chase Atlas before it escapes the solar system forever. NASA has not approved it, not yet. By August, the European Herschel Observatory captured the final image, a dim blue spark. One last flash, then nothing. Atlas slipped into interstellar night, gone, maybe forever. No explosion, no debris, no trace, just silence. A silence that doesn't happen by accident. Today, 3i Atlas continues its journey. An enigma drifting through ancient starlight, carrying secrets humanity may never decode. Maybe it was a relic, maybe a probe, maybe a messenger. But one thing is certain, for a brief moment in time, the universe whispered, and we were listening. If this story left you curious, like the video, share it and subscribe to Zid Wisdom because the stars are still watching.